Hey guys, I'm Dev back with another Affinity Photo tutorial. At first, Happy New Year to all of you those who are watching my this video. And this is my first video on 2022. Now this video is not completely Affinity Photo tutorials, but some part later we will use Affinity Photo. Now just a brief info, two years back Photoshop introduced an option called Neuro Filters and on that Neuro Filters they bring a filter called Auto Colorize. Trust me, it's a great feature and save lots of time and need no special skill. Absolutely brilliant for those who really wanted to colorize their old photography. With the help of AI artificial intelligence, your any old vintage black and white photo will become in color within just a few seconds. Now, till today when I am uploading this video on 5th January 2022, Affinity Photo do not have this type of features yet, but I am sure they will bring this type of features very soon. So till now, we Affinity Photo user has to do all by ourselves manually to make any black and white photo to color. And really, it takes a bit more time if you are not professional user. So today, I will share a free tool to save your time and need no special skill to make your any black and white photo to color in just a few seconds. So are you ready? Let's jump to browser and type imagecolorizer.com. Link in this video description you can follow the link. It's 100% safe, secure and it's a HTTPS site. You can use it without a shadow of doubt. Now click on it. This is the interface and here lots more options they are providing you as a free service and one of them is AI colorizer means by the help of artificial intelligence. So click on it. Now here you can read those things what they are saying AI technology Based on the AI technology, we train the system to colorize the black and white photos in only a few seconds. That's good. Colorize old photos. No Photoshop skills required to colorize black and white photos. Upload your old photo, leave the pixel job to our picture colorizer. Sound good. All upload item will be clear every 24 hours, no photo will be restored and used for other purpose without your permission. That's great. Now here, click or drag and drop file options. So I am dragging one of my sample image and click start. It will just take a few seconds. And done. Click to download it. Now let me finish my two more samples then we will go through in a deep details. Similar way. Okay, my three sample of black and white photo, two color, done. One more thing, sometimes if we place more than two images at a time, then they will say below the image too many in a red mark. Don't worry, finish your first two images work, then refresh 
this side and do it again okay now here are those sample images that i use for auto colorize this one color and this one original black and white photo source it's pretty awesome and save lots of times and energy now things need to understand that this is done by auto colorize ai system so it cannot be 100 percent correct or sometimes ai color output depends on image to image but we always have an option to adjust those things with affinity photo Whenever 30 minutes manually colorize work done on 30 seconds, then we can give 3 minutes to adjust those images, right? Now our main 90% hard work already done. And now we need few adjustments on these images to make even more better. Now open Affinity Photo. And I'm placing all my 3 images here. Now let's start few adjustment. Let's start with this image. This is an option we can use. We can use commonly like HSL, reduce saturation. Some lens filter. color balance these are the processes but I would always suggest you use develop persona the best for image adjustment go to left top develop persona now here we can use exposure increase decrease brightness you do not need to follow all the steps i am doing here because i am using these steps for my image so feel free check those options and use one by one according to your image those options are depends on image to image okay vibrance some white balance shadows and highlights now it's looking great When you are satisfied with your image adjustment, then hit left top develop to apply and finish this work. Looking great. Let's bring that auto color image and check side by side. See the difference? Right side auto color, left one after auto color and image adjustment with affinity photo. On my opinion, left one is more better one. Now add sharpness on the image, go to top menu, filters, sharpen, unsharp mask. And done. Please comment me in this video how you like my this adjustment. I will happy to get your feedback. Now let's finish the rest two images adjustment by using same steps develop persona
here right side original source of black and white image and left one auto color plus adjustment with affinity photo i hope you find this video helpful if you like my work with affinity photo then subscribe this affinity vibe youtube channel to get more amazing affinity photo effect tutorials you can support me on my instagram account link in video description and also you can check out the other amazing video just waiting for you in this channel playlist thanks for watching and i will back with another video soon till then keep practicing because practice makes us perfect and have fun with affinity photo Thank you.